Hey there, so I just wanted to share you some knowledge about vegetable pads and how to use this. This is like uh, one of the top features in this app. These features skyrocketed this app to the top charts of the App Store. It's also now available on Android finally. So it's pretty cool. Um, so basically here you have your pads. You just tap on the pad. First you need to hatch an egg. So you need to tap go hatch an egg and then uh, the egg is hatching basically and from the egg you will get a new path. You can speed it up, uh, but uh, yeah, that's basically it. And then you will have your paths. You can filter them. Uh, I have a lot already. I need to say that design of this uh, section of the app is changing constantly. There are a lot of updates, so it might look completely different when you see this video, like because it was just changed like a few weeks ago and it's now it's completely different to what it was before. But basically you have your pads and the coolest feature of these pads is that you can compare them. So if you just have a pad, you can just tap on this uh, first tab from the left and then you can invite friend to co-parent uh, co this pad with. And then the pad will travel between your screen and your friend's screen. You can uh, send messages to each other with this pad and then you can invite, and then you can just have this virtual pet which are growing together with your friend, which is pretty cool feature there. Uh, and, you know, instead of, you know, sending like boring messages to each other, you can just use the pet. But then there is a pet, and of course the whole idea is that you need to take care of the pet. There are multiple ways how to do it, but basically you need to constantly do three things. You need to feed it, that's the first step, that you need to take it to the bathroom, and then you need to give it some drinks. So these are basics, but in top left, you have your levels, so level of the path. And here you need to look carefully. Basically, you don't need just sporadically give it some food or anything. You just need to tap on this info icon and then see path growth instructions. Like you need to take care of your path and it will keep growing. It will learn new skills to bring you some great rewards that it grows up. So, but you need like fit, it with daily food ones that gives you 10 points, feed it with premium food ones that gives you 30 points, help it go to the bathroom that gives you 10 points, bath it with the bath bomb that gives you 30 points. So my point is you don't need to feed it like, you know, so many times per day because it will just waste points. So you can get up to 100 XP per day. And then for example, the first level, you need to get more than 150 XP. Then uh, the second level you need to uh, get like 500 XP. So that's at least additional four days if you're just feeding it and taking care of it maximally. And then there is a thousand XP. So that's basically how you get all these next points and how you go through the levels and how you get these rewards. Uh, so that's the idea. Uh, and then, yeah, so that's what it is. So, and then for example, the pet says I'm hungry and it suggests specific food you need to feed it. So if the pet wants salad, you can't feed it with fish or not. So if I just tap a nut, the pet doesn't want it. So then like, then you usually will just have one item of each in the beginning. But then this app becomes quite expensive where you need to uh yeah you need to buy all this stuff but don't hurry up to buy them there is shop where once per like sir uh three hours uh you can get a bad package every three hours um so you can just do that you can watch some ads get some additional food of course then you can buy it but you know, if you just start buying food, it's getting pretty expensive. One apple is like one dollar here. So yeah, and then the next thing with the food is the same, but just with the basing. Um, then uh, the same with the water drink. And then there are some additional uh, things like music. You can enable music for your pet, but then unfortunately it's only available with vegetable premium. You can't get it even by watching ads or anything. So that's what it is. And then there is co-parenting. So with this pad, there is co-parenting uh, available. And then, yeah, that pad is just travels between your friend's phone and your phone. You can send some notes. 
uh, and you can deliver messages, message to each other. There is pet interaction where you can just send miss a pet or care reminder. It's like pretty funky features. It's very nice if you install this pet as a widget. Uh, so as a widget, it kind of looks like this. So here you see this home screen widget. You can also install it as a lock screen widget. Um, so that's that. And then, yeah, in the top right, you can enable disable sound for this pad. You can change name. You can change the background of the pad notifications. Also, if you're not happy, you can just end co-parenting. Um, so that's that. Then there is like history, history of interaction, history of pet notes. But I'm not sure if you can delete them. Uh, and then also you can chat with the pet. Uh, it's like kind of chat GPT AI chat. Um, so you can try that. There are of this uh, chat, unfortunately, is limited in a free version. So that's that. Then there is pet decoration, notifications, change name. You can just change the name of your pet and change how your pet calls you. So all the things you can change. In the top left also, you can see like the energy levels of your pet. This is different from XP levels. To make your pet energetic, you need to feed it the food it wants and the premium foods when it's hungry. Each pet has its own taste. So that's basically the idea. Um, then there are also some lucky draws. Uh, so you can get some, uh, redeem the chances to draw. There is a, if you have premium, there is a free draw chance per day. And then uh, you can complete these uh, tasks in the bottom and then you will get some draws. Um, you will get some lucky draws. Um, then there is like a pet sitting, turn on the pet sitting and it will help take care of your pet. Unlock the pet sitting feature by subscribing, allowing and up your pet to level five. Um, so here you have that. Actually, you know, this app has so many features locked under Vegetable Premium that in the end, probably if you like this app, you just probably will need to upgrade because all these foods it just will get like really expensive. So, and Vegetable yearly is like really cheap actually, it's just like $20. There is also a lifetime option of $50. So that's that. Uh, so there you have it. These are the options. And yeah, that's, that's what it is. This feature again is changing a lot. It's quite advanced on iOS, iPhones, but it's a bit limited on Androids. But yeah, that's what it is. Uh, again, try it out if you like widgets, especially if you like to interact with your friends or your partner in some like uh, interesting way. So give it a try. It's a very cool app, which is, you know, Vegetable Overall was just like a widgets app. Like, you know, installing lock screen widgets, uh, whatso whatever, like wallpapers. But when they enable this patch feature, it's really took off, uh, especially among teenagers. Uh, so give it a try.